Hi and welcome to another installment of Math Basics, Mr. Besh. Today this is a little tutorial on uh, converting a standard form equation into a slope-intercept form equation. So let's start off with an equation in standard form. We have 6x plus 3y is equal to 18. So now there are three steps when you transform a standard form equation into an equation in slope-intercept form. Step number one, divide all your terms by the b value in the standard form equation. Now look where b's at. b is the coefficient in front of y. The thing you want to pay attention to is its sign as well. Sometimes it's negative, sometimes it's positive. In this example, in front of y you have a plus 3, so that's positive 3. Your first step is to take all three terms and divide them by 3. What happens is 6x becomes 2x, plus 3y becomes plus 1y, and over here, do not forget the right-hand side of the equation, 18 divided by 3 gives you 6. So that's my first step. Now the second step that we have is we need to rid the equation of the x term on the left side. And here we go. 2x is over here on the left-hand side. If the x term is positive, which 2x is, you subtract it from both sides. If it were negative, you'd add it to both sides. So now, what you have is minus 2x on the left, minus 2x here on the right. These guys become a 0, and what you're left with is 1y over here. Remember, you do not need to 1 in front of y. And then now, on this side, because they're not like terms, you're going to have 6 minus 2x. Now finally, the step number 3, and this is the easy step, all we have to do is rearrange it. We have to take on the... Uh, right hand side here we have to take the positive 6 and the negative 2x and flip flop them around because it has to be in the form y equals mx plus b so as a result once we rearrange those terms our equation in slope intercept form is y is equal to negative 2x plus 6 now that you have the rule here's another example let's start with this equation in standard form 4x minus 12y is equal to negative 9 so first step, take the b value. This time it's negative 12. Divide all three terms by negative 12. 4x divided by negative 12 gives you negative 1 third x. Negative 1 twelfth y divided by negative 12 gives you positive 1 y. And over here, a negative 9 divided by a negative 12 is going to give us positive 3 fourths. That's step number one. Step number two now we have to rid the equation of the x term over here on this side. So now what we got to do is we have to do the opposite of minus one third x. And that is plus one third x to the left and right. When this simplifies, we get one y or y is equal to three fourths plus one third x. Finally, step number three, we just need to do a little rearranging. Take the one-third uh, x and three-fourths and flip-flop them around. And then at last, we got our equation in slope-intercept form. I hope you found this video both helpful and informative.